Hi, I'm Nancy Joy, and I wanted to talk to you just a little bit about the ninth wave of unity consciousness of the Mayan calendar. I have started a Heartlight's blog called Riding the Wave, and it really is all about what this last uh, period of the Mayan calendar is telling us, and this is really helpful information. The Mayan calendar uh, charts the evolution of our planet uh, from around 15 to 16 billion years ago. And the first um, wave was from the Big Bang in creating cellular structure was uh, 16.4 billion years ago that that began. Now the thing about these waves, uh, they, they are simultaneous. We are still creating cells. The Big Bang of our universe is still out there creating. And in fact, that's what's so exciting about this time. So one through eight waves are simultaneously creating. It isn't like one wave stops and another wave begins. So this is one reason why we're all feeling that time is speeding up so dramatically, um, because it really is. In fact, um, Barbara Hanclau says um, the frequencies of creation that are speeding up they are speeding up by factors of 20, and that all nine will culminate simultaneously uh, when the Mayan calendar ends. Um, and I'll get into a little bit of that, but what I want to say to you that's really important, I, so I've created, I'm, I'm a template doer. I activate grids and templates. I work with the emotional field and Ezekiel. And Ezekiel has encouraged me to create a ride the wave blog. So um, that, and, and it's listed right below here for YouTubers, those of you getting my email, it's right at the top. It'll give you information about the ninth wave of unity consciousness, about ceremonies going on at various times, sacred journeys. And, you know, this is coming to everybody. So, I mean, I'm not creating Ride the Wave. There's probably many different versions of this. Uh, I know a good friend of mine, Susan Chumsky, is organizing a cruise um, for the first day of the ninth wave, which is March 8th and 9th of 2011, uh, with Carl Callinan, who wrote this book of, about uh, deciphering the Mayan code and the calendar. Uh, terrific, right on the day when I'll be in Egypt with hopefully a group of some of you um, for that open doorway. On July 17th, have you heard me talk about that's when we open the door of conscious convergence to awaken to unity consciousness and begin that process. But the actual wave is from March 8th, 2011 to March 28th, 2011, not December 21st, 2012. And from what Ezekiel has told me, uh, the December 21st, 2012 date, it's like at the end of the unity consciousness wave in October 2011, it's kind of like you breathe out. And then there's that pause before you breathe in again, creating the new. The new. Um, so it is the end of an evolutionary cycle, not only for our planet, but beyond. And so it's big. And the important thing is that we are creating now unity consciousness. And what that means is it doesn't mean we're all going to become one and you're going to lose yourself. Unity conscious means each unity consciousness means each individual and unique spark of God creator that is us will become united in, in unison with every other individual and unique spark of God creator. And we will create things together as well as individually. So there's a fear that lies behind some kind of unity consciousness that you're going to lose yourself. And this is not, not really what's going on. So these are exciting, exciting times. Please read the blog and please, please, please pass it on to as many people as you want. Let's create a ride the wave momentum here. Um, and, and what that's about is remembering with each thought and each feeling and each each choice you make to every experience you create um, is activating and anchoring that unity consciousness in ourselves and on the planet. So this is really important. 
Uh, let's join hands today and let's ride the wave um, and have some fun with this. There's a lot of exciting events. I know Heart Lights alone, we have six journeys coming up uh, to anchor and activate the wave around the world, New Zealand and Glastonbury, the Yucatan, Egypt, whatever, and on and on. And there are many other things going on. So if you have something going on, write to me. I'll post it on the blog. If you have something you want to say, I'll post that on the blog. And uh, let's get the wave um, in our consciousness moving now. And we can, um, we will, and we are riding this wave together. So thanks for listening. Enjoy the blog and check out the new Heartlight site, all the journeys coming up. And we'll be talking to you soon. Have a great day. Bye.